I bloody love this place. Right, let's crack on. We've got 114 miles to go. That there is Loch Lomond. Just put a splash of fuel in. We've now turned off the A83 again. A little bit of a back road. Tarmac's very nice. This bit's not. Spoke too soon. Yeah, it's like uh, another conveyor belt up and down Loch Loman. But just having a countryside bimble. Loving life. How cool is this? No idea what it is. I know it's a shopping thing now, but don't know what it was originally. I think we're in Dumbarton or around that way. Anyway, it's a lot of bloody traffic until we get to the other side of Glasgow, I'm hoping. I think it's going to be stop start till we get to the other side of Glasgow. This could put me back about an hour, and this could be a 10 hour ride. But I shall spare you from the misery. It's not as picturesque now, is it? <laughs> Coming up to, is it the Erskine Bridge? The something bridge, Erskine, Eskimo. It's a bridge, and we're on it. Oh, it's like a Dartford. It's like a Dartford crossing this. I wonder in Glasgow if they treat this river the same as we treat the Thames, like North and South Divide. <laughs> like it's a different species north of the river. Is it the same in Glasgow? Let me know. Oh, back on a 60. Let's go. Let's make some mileage up. We are now in Houston, not Texas, Houston, Scotland. We are currently in St. Johnston. I've forgotten how much I hate cities. I like villages. Is this a city, town? Don't know, a bit run down. I'm sure they're nice bits, but I don't seem to be going through any of those. I thought it'd be quicker to cut through this way and to go back to the middle of Scotland the way I came up because that was all full, full Kirk. Didn't like that at all. Seems to be this strip in this middle bit here. It's like no man's land. The strip between Edinburgh and Glasgow. Is there a nice way through this bit? Tell me downstairs in the comment section. Because I don't know. I mean, it's interesting for all the wrong reasons. It's not picturesque, obviously. It is sad to see that there's so much neglect in a country that has so much beauty in it. We're now back on the good stuff. Sounds like drugs, doesn't it? I don't mean that. Well, it is like a drug. Beautiful roads and beautiful scenery on a motorcycle. Definitely could be likened to drugs. Oh dear, you know what I'm going to miss the most? Going back to the south of England. Is the fact... So I should sit down so you hear me. Is the fact that they don't have hedges up here, hedgerows. 
in Sussex and Surrey you've got to because scum nick everything there's up here you can see for miles on some of the roads oh this is the life Uh, rolling around corners in the wrong gear. Come on, you can do it! East Renfrewshire. Renfrewshire. Yeah, that place. That place. That's where we are. The Bonnie Toon of Stew Wharton. That wasn't me being Scottish, I was just uh, read that underneath. And you've got to stay that last bit, it said Toon. T-O-U-N. Although I was probably more Geordie. We've got 43 miles to go. have been pretty good a few little towns and villages but on the whole pretty much like this which is uh, similar to what I ride in England <laughs> just thought I'd check in with you I missed out all the boring bits for you guys I had to suffer it I didn't want to make you suffer like the 20 mile an hour little towns and the run down bits and the horrible bits and the industrial estates but can't all be glory on a ride you know it would be nice if it was but not all glory on this one beginning brilliant middle section a little bit meh but broke it up interesting to me just having a little look around and nosy and now we're on the last 42 miles Just stopped to change the battery last one today i hope 28 miles to go we've got 19 miles on this road put the gloves on the right hand so that might be a good start that's how tired i am oh dear the middle bit has been draining first bit absolutely fantastic middle bit completely draining this is my i don't know what's the day saturday so i left last saturday with a Saturday, Sunday in the same place, but since last Sunday I've been on the go every day, a minimum of I think eight hours a day riding. But 19 miles on this road, and I think this is the road that takes us through the Galloway National Forest, or the Galloway Forest, or the Galloway National Park, or the Forest of Galloway. Yeah, I know what I'm talking about. So, Let's crack on and let's ride.
Oh, wow. What a route. I've never heard of this place. It's just, there was a place I wanted to stop off at, which is Newton Stewart, which kind of logistically made sense for my trip. And I saw this and I thought, why not risk it for a biscuit and stick a route through here? And I've got to say, it's bloody fantastic, yet again. Sheep and cows, sharing the field, all getting along. Gotta say, I did not expect this. I'm so pleasantly surprised. Yet again, Scotland delivers. Just past the sign there, we're now officially in the forest. Galloway National Forest. I still can't remember, I just saw the bloody sign. Galloway Forest National Park. Galloway Forest Park. Anyway, whatever the Galloway is, we're in it. And it's stunning. I didn't expect mountains here. I don't know why, but I didn't. This trip never ceases to amaze me. I've never heard of this place. Why have I never heard of this place? It's bloody beautiful. With the evening sun as well. Oh, oh, oh. I've been blessed on this trip. Three days of pure sunshine and heat. On the way up, heated grips on, winter gloves, liners in, waterproofs on. Last three days in Scotland, thermal lining out. Summer gloves on, no waterproofs. Oh, it's been bliss, absolutely bliss. And it just keeps on giving. I was struggling in that middle pit. I was feeling a little bit melancholy, like it's done. I mean, I'm looking forward to the Lake District, but I have a feeling that might be a little bit busy. And I thought these roads were done. These views were done. And just when I was feeling a little bit sad, almost, I was reminiscing about the good times this morning. This dropped in my lap. 
what a way to pick me up at the end of the day. miles to go until we get there. What an epic end to the day. We've just arrived at Newton Stewart. This is the town I'm staying in. It was just a strategic point on a map on my journey back to the lakes. And I might just have lucked out on this one. Gateway to the Galloway Hills really happening on a Saturday night. It's got a cinema. I know that because it says the cinema. Get out your bags, get out my house. I don't want your stuff around. I never did you wrong, but you did me wrong. So go ahead, get go, gone. Get out your bags, get out my house. I don't want your stuff around. I never did you wrong, but you did me wrong. So go ahead and get